What's up, team? Oh, yeah, it's your boy Cal with another one. Yeah, I'm sweating like a dog. Yeah, it's been a minute. Y'all saw the last video, me closing on my dream home. And why I call it my dream home is because growing up from where I grew up, you know, we didn't have a good school district. You know, we were, I didn't grow up in the safest neighborhood. And it's time to talk about what do you do after you didn't purchase all these properties in the, uh, from the Detroit Land Bank? You didn't bought these investment properties. Now you got cash flow. You got money on hand. What do you do with? I'm going to tell you what I'm doing. I invested in myself again and I purchased my dream house. So now I can put my sons in a better school district to give them better opportunities that I didn't have. You know, I got my uh, I got my house for a great deal. Now it's time to renovate it. It's time to get busy. So as you can see, I got my work cut out for me. So it's going to be a complete kitchen demo renovation. I'm going to be adding a wall here. <clears throat> as you can see, I got all my materials. New refrigerator. <clears throat> got the microwave there. It's going to be a complete bathroom renovation. I'm tearing all this out. All this is coming out. All the tile is coming out. New tub. <clears throat> And I'm not going to show you guys everything just yet. Um, so y'all gonna have to wait. Um, but also, too, I'm still working on an apartment building. And as I <clears throat> and as I say to all my haters and everything like this, I didn't think I was going to ever get haters because I'm giving out free information. And, I, and, you know, like, you know, I'm helping people out. But for the haters, you know. At the end of the day, I don't care about what you think or how you think I should do things. At the end of the day, if you do not like my content, you can definitely go follow some of the other people that are, you know, just starting out doing what I have already done. As I stated before, I have purchased 13 properties from the Detroit Land Bank. So I might know a little something. So, <laughs> but hey. Um, but it is what it is. Um, at the end of the day, we ain't take out no loans. We, <laughs> this is from nine to five working. You understand? Hard work, dedication. So, um, I'm going to get back to it. Uh, my, actually my, uh, my camera <laughs> memory card is full. So I got to figure that out. Um, so I'm actually using my cell phone to record this. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to give you guys one last look at this kitchen um, all this, all this coming out. Um, I got the new cabinets and the transit, so I'm about to get busy. It's time to get it in. No days off, but I am going to do something special with this island right here. So because I couldn't find an island to match the cabinets, I'm going to be, the cabinets are white. So I'm actually going to be changing out the doors. I'm going to find the exact size doors in the cabinet size that I, you know, that I purchased. And I'm just gonna swap them out and paint it white. No one, no one's gonna know. So yeah, so let's get it. Um, also, like I said before, if you got questions and stuff, leave them in the, the uh, you know, leave them in the comments below. I, I get back to everybody in a timely fashion. Um, or you can email me as well. I respond back or you can join my Facebook group called Building Detroit Investors. I answer a lot of questions. Um, I will be retiring from purchasing properties uh, from the Detroit Land Bank, but I am still well connected with the guy, uh, with that, with the people over there and their teams and stuff like that. And also, I got a special surprise to share with you guys. And the only way I was able, uh, how to explain this? So it's one big question that people have about the land bank and will the land bank take your house back? So I'm gonna drop drop that on you guys. I said I wasn't gonna you know talk about it, but I'm but as you got as you guys know, I keep it real, I keep it 100. You get straight raw footage from me, 
you know, really don't do too much editing. I mean, that junk take a long time. I ain't got time for that. So y'all just gonna get get it how, you, how I live, all right? But, and also if you watch it to this, to this point here, I would like for you to subscribe to the channel. Sometimes I say subscribe in the beginning, but I mean, if you watch it to this end, maybe you like something, you know, hey, subscribe to the channel, show me some love. The more subscribers I get, maybe YouTube might send me a check and I can make more content. You know what I'm saying? But for now, I still got to live. So I got to <laughs> I got to do the best I can, guys. You know, uh, but all right, man, I appreciate you guys. I love y'all for still rocking with me, but we're still working on an apartment building. We had a rainstorm a couple of days ago that actually damaged the roof. So I got uh, who I got coming out. Our Hanson's is coming out. So hopefully they're able to give me a good deal on replacing the whole roof. Oh, Jesus Christ. But yeah, it is what it is. All right, you guys, you stay tuned, stay blessed. Um, and let's get it. And if you're if you tired, go to church. <laughs> All right, bye.